the 2A Tigers will enter Bolivar County battle-tested, having faced three larger classification schools so far this season. Always up for the challenge and never one to shy away from stiff competition. They say they plan to play with a chip on their shoulder when they clash with the unbeaten 5 and 8 Wolves. They're just taking it personal since, you know, they undefeated. They feel like since we are two-way, they're going to come run us over. They feel like we're going to go there and they're going to dog us out, so we got to show them what we're really about. For one, they 4 no this year. They're doing way better than they were last year. We just have we got a chance to play and what they, they be, what they feel like they'd be. I feel like we better. As long as long we maintain their quarterback, it's going to be a good ball game. What is it going to take to, to keep them maintained? Because a lot of people put haven't. Lot, put a lot of pressure on them. I got faith in my defense. That's confidence there for you. Now, the quarterback uh, from Cleveland Central he's referring to is Jay Beeman. He's just a junior, folks, who has a cannon of an arm. He's also surrounded by a wealth of talent. However, Jay B and the Wolfpack quick to point out talent alone won't get the job done, which is why they don't plan to take the Tigers lightly. In my understanding, football is football. Class is class, you know. However you want to play it, you're going to play it. We wait. We ready. We coming. So, we coming. They don't look like they too much like throwing. Mm -hmm. So, we stopped the run game. I feel like they going to be uncomfortable for the rest of the night. Charleston has a long history with Cleveland. With, you know, before the schools even combined, you know, the fans are excited about it. You know, the kids are excited.